everyone! Welcome to my channel and welcome to another edition of Subscription Box Sunday. Today, I have 11 different boxes to share with you guys. This is the biggest Subscription Box Sunday video that I have ever done. I've never not been able to count it on my fingers, so I am so excited to dive in with it with you all. And we do have a couple new boxes to the channel, which is always exciting. But in this week's lineup, we have the Copper and Pine Co. subscription, the Silver and Gold Jewelry subscription, the Simply Earth subscription, the Red Box of Wellness subscription, the Cacao Chocolate subscription, a Haldi Skincare Refresh, the Bath Bevy and Bath Bevy Tubless boxes, the Silver Swag box, and the Go Jewelry Manifestation box, as well as the Go Jewelry Mother Earth Wrap Club. And with that, welcome back to all the sub box lovers out there. Welcome if you're new. My name is Katrina, and on this channel, I unbox lots of subscription boxes. And on Sundays, I like to unbox multiple subscriptions in one video so you can see them all at once. So if you like these subscription box Sunday videos, make sure that you give this one a big thumbs up and make sure that you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on future uploads. And let's dive in. I am so happy that you're here hanging out with me today, unboxing all of these boxes. I don't even know how long it's going to take me to film this. This is probably going to be a longer video, so definitely make sure that you grab a snack, grab a drink, let's hang out. Um, now, because there are so many boxes, I am going to have to move somewhat quickly to get through, of, through all of them, um, but I'm still really excited to dive in. We are going to kick things off with the Copper and Pine Candle Co. Scent of the Month Club. This is a monthly candle and wax melt subscription where each month you get like a different scent um, for the month, and I'm so excited to dive in. Now, they do have different subscription options, and I believe the one that I have is the Ultimate Sniffer Box, which retails for $46.99 a month, uh, plus shipping. All these subscriptions have shipping on top of that. So this one comes with wax, melt, wax melts and a candle. Um, and then there's the candle sniffer, which just is a candle for $38.99. The mini melt sniffer box where you just get wax melts is $38.99. And then they do also have 10 freshener subscriptions. So it's $10 for one or $18 for two. Um, those two, the freshener subscriptions have free shipping. The other ones you do have to pay for shipping. I will say that every single box in this video was has sent to me free for review today and I've loved the boxes that she sent to me previously. The scents have been so delicious. And I do have a coupon code down below where you can get one of those free tin fresheners with your subscription. Now that only applies to the first three subscriptions. You don't, it does not apply to the actual tin subscription. So if you get like the candle wax melt subscription and you use my code, then you can get a free tin. Now, if you want the March box, which is the box that I'm unboxing today, you do have to sign up by Monday at 10 p.m. And Monday as in, let me look at the calendar, make sure I say it right, the 13th of February. So I know this video is going up on the 12th of February. So you have like one day to go in and I don't know if it's 10, p what like time zone the 10 p.m. is. So I'm just gonna say 10 p.m. Eastern to be on the safe side. So make sure that you go in if you want this box and do that by Monday, the 13th of February, 2023 at 10 p.m. Eastern. When you open up the box, this is what it looks like. It says, get your sniffer ready. Oh my gosh, it definitely looks kind of like St. Patrick's Day, which I am here for. You do normally get like a free gift type thing with the box. And historically it's been these towels, which I'm so excited. These are the, what are these from? What are they called again? These are the geometry tea towels. And I actually found out about these towels from this box. And I love these so much that I've gone out and purchased some from the geometry site. Look how cute this is. Now I love these tea towels because while they are cute and decorative. They are also very functional. I don't know exactly what the material they're made out of, but it's really, it actually absorbs. It actually works. It's not like one of those tea towels that you can't actually use. Um, and you can wash them. They wash great. And this one's just so cute with the little, um, clover and the rainbow. And if you really like it and you want a set, you can go, they have tons of different designs. So I like to buy different designs and pair them together, but I am absolutely like obsessed with this. I'm so excited to like hang this up in my kitchen in March. Now each month has a specific scent, so the candle and the wax melts will smell the same, um, but we're gonna start with the candle. Um, the candle is sweet lemon. Well, they're both they're both sweet lemon, and so it has notes of lemon, citrus, and bergamot. I really love the containers that the candles are in. They're in a nice, I don't know if it's ceramic, but like a white ceramic type material with a bamboo lid. 
and it does have that like sealant that you can kind of close it in with and this is what it looks like okay let's smell it oh it smells so good it smells so good and it's this is gonna sound insane it smells like March lemon like it smells like st. Patrick's Day lemon and I don't know how to it's kind of like a like a fruit loopy lemon type of scent that you would associate with like rainbows I don't know it smells really good it's a really sweet yummy lemon oh I like this a lot I wish you guys had smell vision so you could smell this because it smells really really good Oh my goodness. Okay. And like I said, I love the container. It's super simple. If you don't want the label showing, you just flip it the other way around and it can be super plain. And I just, oh, I really, her scents are so good. Then you get your little wax melts. Look how cute these are. They are rainbow. They, they come always with this little wooden scoop so you can scoop them out. Uh, it's in the same scent as the candle. So you just get a nice little thing. Oh my goodness. Oh, so good. And that's what they look. I like, Definitely keep these away from kids though because they kind of look like candy and I want to eat them. And you have four ounces of wax melts in here. These are so, so cute. And honestly, I am actually obsessed with this scent this month. So you can obviously get the ultimate sniffer, which this is the ultimate sniffer box where you get a candle and wax melts. But if you prefer just a candle or you prefer just wax melts, then you also have um, that subscription option. But I do also have the tin freshener in this box. Now this does not normally come with a subscription. If you use my code, you will get a tin freshener. I don't know if it will be in this scent if you use my code, but if you do get the March t like tin scent, then I think it would be this one. So I love these. If you don't know what the tin freshener is, it's basically, you can use it for a lot of things. These are great as like car fresheners and it's like a non-liquid air freshener. So it's not going to get melty or gross or things like that. Oh, it smells so good. So this is good for like small spaces and things like that. So you can take it and you can put it down like that to leave it open. And if you want to keep the scent longer, then you can close it like this. Um, I have been, I have one of these. I put it in a drawer, like a drawer shelf thing that I bought. Um, and it smelled very strong, like chemicals. You know how sometimes when you build new furniture and I didn't pay a lot for it, it wasn't like super, super fancy. It just had that like ugh, smell. So I put one of these in the drawer of it and now it smells incredible. And every time I open the drawer, it just like, there's like a, of, it's like an apple, it's like a fall scent. So it smells really, really nice. Um, so this is great too for a car, like a diaper changing station, um, anything like that. Um, where you kind of want a mask scent. You could put this in a drawer um, ugh, and they smell so good and they're super potent and they last a really long time. I don't know what the claim is for them, but for me, this lasts a really long time. It probably makes a difference whether or not you're closing it or leaving it open. Um, if you leave it open, it's probably going to, the scent's probably going to go away quicker versus I keep closing it and then reopening it. And ugh, mine has lasted me quite a few months now. Um, the ones that I already have. So these are great. So that is everything in the March copper and pine box. I thought it was so good. I'm so, it feels really March and I love a good themed box that feels like the month or the season that it's in. And this, the scent, the little towel, ugh, it feels so, so March. And one of the things that I love about this box, it's like a small women owned company. So you know that you're really helping out a small business when you do this. Um, so I will leave a link down below in case you're interested in signing up. Again, there'll be a coupon code down there as well. If you want to get a free tin freshener with your subscription, as long as you're subscribing to like the candle and wax melt subscriptions that will apply. The next box that I'm going to unbox is the silver and gold jewelry box subscription. Um, this is a monthly jewelry subscription where you get two pieces of jewelry each month plus a free gift for $49 a month. Now, if you sign up for like three, six, 12 month versions of the subscription, you can get it for a little bit cheaper. And they provided me a lot more information that I wanna share since this is actually the first time I'm unboxing it on my channel. The jewelry items that would be included in the subscriptions are things like earrings, necklaces, bracelets, and rings, if you send them your ring size. Um, their jewelry is always sterling silver and or gold. There's no mystery metals and it's stamped. Um, their jewelry also can include pearls and gemstones, both natural and imitation, in fun and sophisticated styles. So you can add tried and true classics to your jewelry collection or try new and fun styles you may not have picked yourself. Now, the monthly box also does come with a free gift. They've included a couple for me to share with you guys, so I'll show them in a second. But just some gifts that you could get are like a travel jewelry box, ring coils to adjust your ring size fit, magnetic clasps, 
Um, so you can move your necklaces on easier. Ring size or wrist size or jewelry trees or trays, gemstone keychains, jewelry cleansers, polishing cloths, and more. Um, and then on your one year anniversary, they'll send you a pair of genuine moissanite earrings. I don't know if I pronounced that right. And you keep what you get in the subscription. It's not like where you send anything back. So once you pay it, you get it. All right, let's look at some of the free gifts that we got beforehand. So one of them that I got is this here. This is the multi-sizer ring size gauge. Ooh, I've had one of these before and they're really great. So basically what it is, is this thing here that you can wrap around your finger to figure out what your ring size is. So example, for example, my ring right here is a size six, which I already knew. This one's a size five. Like you can go around and measure your fingers with this, which I think is great because different fingers are have different sizes. So my thumb is gonna be different from some of my other fingers. So a nice little ring sizer. I think that's an amazing add-on gift. Then there's also a ring coil. So it says loose rings, not anymore. Now I'll be honest, I don't know exactly how this works, but I'm assuming you cut this and you can put it around your ring so that your ring is no longer loose. I'm assuming you only need a portion of this just because of how big this is. So it can help if you do have a loose fitting ring or like if your fingers get, you know, change sizes or whatever, it could help with that. And then I have magnetic clasps. So it looks like here I've got a gold and a silver magnetic clasp. I'm not gonna take them out of the bags because I don't know how to take this one out because it's like a double um, thing, but you just clip it onto each end of the necklace and then you have the magnetic piece on the back. So you can just pull it if you have a hard time getting to the back of your neck or necklace, especially if you have any sort of like dexterity issues or whatever, you could put this on the necklace and then it'll be much easier for you to like apply and take it off. Cause how many times have you sat there and try to like get the clasp on the necklace and you can't figure it out. You have to like look in the mirror if you don't have anybody to help you. So those are just a couple examples of the free gifts that you could get with the box. But now let's get into the good stuff, the actual contents. Oh what my goodness, this is so pretty. <gasps> So this is the set that I received. This is the 14 karat gold um, over sterling silver sparkle hoop pendant and earrings. This retails for $132 according to the back of this box. This is so, so pretty. So there's like little crystals on the hoops of it. I don't, hopefully it will kind of zoom in. And then you've got some different kind of like gemstone that goes around and like, they're like little rectangle shapes that go around and that I, really wish it would focus better on this. Maybe, can I get it to focus better? I don't know, um, but I really like it. When things are shiny, my camera has a hard time picking up on them. <laughs> All right, I've gone ahead and swapped out the jewelry to put it on. I will say that the clasp on the necklace was super easy to use, super smooth, really nice quality. Um, the little charm, no, I don't necessarily want to call it a charm. It can come off of the necklace. So if you prefer it on a different type of chain or you want to use this chain with something else, you could choose to switch it out. And then the hoops are so pretty. Uh, Y'all know I love a good gold hoop moment. And I really, really like these. I'm a big fan. They're a little bit bigger than the normal hoops that I use. And I also like that this set is like, I'm gonna use the word mature, but I don't mean that in a bad way. Like it's a really nice, mature, high quality jewelry piece set. And I think for the price that it's a really, really good deal for what you get. Now, I don't think that I have a coupon code or anything like that, but I will leave a link down below in case you're interested in signing up. Now, I do wanna clarify that you would only get one gift in your box. They gave me three, but you would only get one in each of the boxes. I really love the jewelry that I got. I actually prefer gold jewelry because it was sent to me free for review. I didn't like give them any information, but if you like silver jewelry, that's an option too. I don't think you get to choose from my understanding, but they do have some really nice jewelry. It does feel high quality and nice. So if you're in the market for a jewelry subscription, this one seems really, really nice. Again, I'll leave all the information down in the description box below and definitely let me know your thoughts. All right, up next, let's dive into the Simply Earth box for February of 2023. Now, I think I've actually reviewed Simply Earth on my channel like way back when, when I was in a different apartment like years ago, and I think I paid for it then. This time it was sent to me free for review. And if you're unfamiliar with, with what the Simply Earth subscription is, it's like an essential oil DIY monthly subscription where you get to make some like clean, um, essential oil recipes for different things depending on the month and what the theme is. I believe the February theme is soap. So the essential oil recipe subscription is $44.99 a month. Um, for your first box, you do get a big bonus box added on for free, which I think is like $47. 
$8.84 in value, at least that's what it says on my sheet here. Now the recipe box, the regular subscription, does come with four full-size essential oils and some extras that are needed for creating the recipes, and there's different themes each month. And then the bonus box basically gives you some little things to work with to help do the recipes. So you get the free bonus box with your first recipe box and every six months of the subscription to help you restock on some of those things that you'll need to help you make those recipes. As part of the subscription, you do also get free essential oil education. Um, so you get um, access to their essential oils hero course um, where you can learn how to use essential oils with confidence and clarity um, and the different ways to use those oils. Now, because this is sent to me free for you, I do have a coupon code down below where you can get a $45 gift card with your first box. The gift card is not a discount on your purchase um, and is an actual gift card that they'll receive in your email after paying for your first box. Um, and then you can use it on your next or future purchases. So I actually think it's a really great code. You obviously have to pay it front, but then you do get that $40, $45, excuse me, gift card that you can use. So I'll leave all of that information down in the description box below. Now, if you're planning on signing up, definitely sign up soon. They do tend to sell out of their subscription boxes. So if this one, you really like the February box, definitely make sure that you sign up soon. A really nice thing about Simply Earth that they do is they donate 13% of their monthly profits to help with a fight human trafficking, which I think is a really, really great thing. So if you're spending money on this box, you can know that part of your money is going something or some going somewhere really good. All right, and now it's time to dive into this big box. So on the outside of the box, it does say that your toxin free journey starts here. And when you open up the big box, that is what it looks like. So inside you have your monthly essential oil box and then all of the other fun things that are part of that like a bonus box. So I'm gonna start off with the bonus box first. So these are all of the things inside of the bonus box now that I've taken the monthly box out. And the bonus box are things, like I said, ingredients or things to use in your subscription. So like the first thing that I'm pulling out is are some beeswax pellets here. So as we get into the monthly box and we look at the recipes, we'll be able to see where maybe some of these things are being used. Um, so these are 100% pure, sulfate-free, and natural skincare. Um, so just little uh, two ounces of beeswax. Then you do get a nice big tub of coconut oil. So it's 100% pure, refined, cold-pressed coconut oil that can be used in the recipes. And then we get a couple of two different carrier oils that can be used. So we have an almond oil, it's 100% pure carrier oil, as well as a fractionated coconut oil, 100% pure um, carrier oil as well. So different carrier oils that you can use in your recipes. And the whole point about the bonus box is I think it'll help last you for those six months until you get your next bonus box and you get kind of replenished with those goods. And then the bottom portion, I don't want to take it all out. You have tons of little vessels. So on top, I think they're just like a little essential oil type bottles. They're nice little amber bottles. And then I'm assuming that these bottom ones are maybe like roller bottles. Yes, they are little roller balls. So you get a set of six roller ball um, holders as well as six essential oil bottles or little oil bottles as well. So that's everything in the big bonus box. Again, you get that free with your first box and then every six months. It's not part of like the normal regular subscription or it is part of the subscription, but not every month. And now let's dive into the February essential oil recipe box. So this is great if you're trying to simplify the products in your life, you don't want toxins. So it says um, simply oil, no additives, made simply from the earth, pure oils, honest prices. Um, and then it looks like you can scan the QR code for tutorials on how to do each of the recipes in this box. Okay, when you open up the monthly box, that is what it looks like. So before we get into all the goodies, you do get a little piece of paper that goes over everything. So the February theme is soap. So you get some oils, four oils, you get some extras that'll help you make what you need to do, and then the recipes or possible recipes that you can make. Actually, it looks like this piece of paper is for me. It's like addressed towards influencers, so I don't know if you will get this in your box, but um, it does give me more information and FAQs. It does here say here that the value of this box that I'm unboxing is $159.44, and you're getting that for that $44.99 fee. All right, so let's talk about the oils first. Like I said, there are four of them. They are in different size. So the first one that I'm doing is a five milliliter. The rest are 15. First one is a cardamom essential oil. And it does give brief safety information on the recipe cards that are gonna be in here. So you've got a little cardamom essential oil. I do wanna smell them, because why not, you know, while we're at it. Mmm, okay. 
that like you feel that up your signs or like in your senses it smells really good it's very strong now I do like to preface any video that I do that includes anything with essential oils to please do your research about essential oil and your specific pets if you have pets different animals um, may be um, allergic toxic it may be deathly to use certain essential oils with them in different capacities so some it might be a problem if they breathe them in if they touch them all that kind of stuff so just do your research on that before using any of these around your pets then we have a simply ginger one these this is the 15 uh, milliliter version Ooh, uh, that definitely smells gingery okay i'm excited then we have a fennel one again this one is in 15 milliliters Ooh, that's my favorite one so far i really like that it kind of has licorice in it it has the aroma is kind of like a black licorice type of scent Ooh, i like that and then finally we have a love essential oil which i'm assuming is going to be a blend it says amorous bergamot sweet orange and ylang ylang essential oil now some i'm not on this one but on some of the other ones it does tell you the origin so the origin of this one is egypt which i think is really nice so let's give this one a sniff Ooh, that smells like botanical greenhouse and bubble gum it smells really good I love that one. Oh my gosh. I love the love one. Love that. Perfect, uh, obviously perfect name for that. One thing that it does have on the back of these that I really like, it says Child Safe 10 Plus um, on it. So it does tell you that and it says 1% um, Kids Max Topical Dilution. So like it does give you safety tips if you have kids and things like that for them, but obviously for pets, do your research. And then you have all the things inside. So there's a bunch of other like goodies and things and the recipe cards. Ah, okay, here is the little pamphlet that you get. So what I had was just for me because this was sent to me, but you do get a little thing here on soap and it has um, everything you need. It basically is talking about how you, you've earned the Soap Hero badge from this box. And it looks like launching on March 6th, they have everything you need to make soap. Okay, interesting. Um, so this might be something a little bit different from the regular subscription, but then you also get the recipe card. So let's see what the recipes are for this month. Ooh, okay, actually they do. Okay, I'm gonna, I need to backtrack. They do give you some instructions on pet safety, but only for cats and dogs. So if you have cats and dogs, great. If you have more like exotic or like the other animals, do your, do your own research. Um, but it does tell you the general safety of each and the uses. So like the loved one supports romantic feelings, the fennel energizes, supports respiration and aids digestion. Um, it tells you whether you need to dilute it before using on the skin, where, how much, what age they need to be as far as kids safe, um, and then whether it's pregnancy safe, cat safe, or dog safe. So I love, love, love um, that they include that on here. I think that's amazing. Again, if you have more exotic pets, they do tend to be a little bit more sensitive to those. So just make sure you do your research. But then the recipe cards, we have the Love Cleansing Shave Soap. And it gives you everything that you need on the card. So it says from your box, what you'll need from your home, what you'll need, how much time it takes the shelf week. I mean, the shelf week, <laughs> the shelf life, um, what it will yield and the dilution rate. So for this one, you'll need, um, some 12 drops of simply earth geoguard ECT preservative, a hand mixer immersion blender. So like it tells you what you would need to do it if you want to do it. And then it gives you all the instructions on how to make it, which is really fun. So if you're somebody who likes to DIY or do little recipes, it could be super fun. Um, the other one is a love massage oil. So this one you use 15 drops of their love essential oil blend, two tablespoons of the almond oil, which you got in the bonus box. And what you would need is a one ounce bottle that you would put it into. So again, it gives you little instructions on there. The cards are nice quality too. Ooh, a cleansing sugar scrub bar. That sounds delicious. The only thing you need from your home is three tablespoons of granulated um, sugar. Everything else comes in that. Um, and ooh, it only takes like 10 minutes. These are so easy. And the love massage oil takes two minutes. These are really easy to do. They're fun. They're fast. This one's a double-sided instruction one because it does have a lot of ingredients in it. Then we also have the bold roll on. Um, again, only takes two minutes to do and everything is in the box for that one. We have the swirled heart soap. Ooh, oh, that's really exciting. This one again is a front and back one. Um, from your home, you need rubbing alcohol and a rubbing alcohol in a spray bottle, but everything else um, you can make using everything that came in the box. Okay, and there's some extra things in here to make this one. And then last but not least, we have the Love is in the Air Diffuser Blend. So if you have an, um, 
like a diffuser in your home, you could kind of mix that together. You don't need anything other than obviously something to diffuse it in. Okay, so those are all the recipe cards that you can make for the month. Then you also get a sticker sheet. Um, guys, like this is so fun. I obviously am not gonna have the time to make anything in this video today because I have so many boxes to get through, but I am like so excited to do this. So it gives you like little things there that maybe you could put on the top lid. You can put, I think you can put these on the, like the lid of your um, essential oil. So if you organize them in like a different thing, you can see what they are. Um, when you make the soap and things like that, you can label like when it was made or when it will expire. You get a soap hero badge. And then for like the roll-ons and the scrub bars and things like that, you get little stickers that you can put on the bottle. So for the roll-on, we do have the little roll-on bottles that we got in the big box and so you could just take that little thing and wrap it around it and then it is labeled and then there's also that love is in the air essential oil blend um which is not this the the love thing it incorporates some of the other things so you would then put that in one of the other smaller essential oil bottles and then you can wrap this around it so that is so cute and then it also has that little top one to put on top of that bottle as well so i love it it's so like organized and fun i cannot wait i cannot wait all right some of the other things that you get in the box is this cute little heart-shaped mold so i think this one specifically is for that heart swirled soap yeah so this is for the swirled heart soap then you also get this fuchsia mica powder which is really fun you get a couple of sachets of that in there and that is also used you use one pinch of that um, for this swirled heart soap maybe it's used in some of the other ones i'm not sure but this is the only one that i saw that you use this in so you get the nice little powder so that you can dye your little soap oh this is so fun and then last but not least you get this here this is the shea butter melt and pour soap. Um, so this is like the ingredients that you can use to kind of help make your soap. So this, like the Swirled Heart Soap Bar, um, you need four cubes of this here to make that. So if you're looking to have a cleaner, more toxin-free lifestyle, if you love using essential oils, or if you just love creating, making, doing things, DIYing things, I think this could be so much fun to do. Obviously, the kids need to be a certain age for this to be an appropriate activity with them so that it's not toxic to them. But I think that this could be a fun thing that you could do with maybe some older children. Um, and I really love this. I can't wait. I'm gonna be like a little, do my little potions and my brews with this. <laughs> like, I just can't wait to um, make some of these things because I think it's a really, really fun activity to do. And these stickers are the thing that's made. I, I don't know why, but the stickers is what's getting me the most excited about this. The fact that I can label the things that I make is like, so exciting. So that is the February Simply Earth monthly box plus the bonus box. I thought it's really fun. It's different from some of the other subscription boxes I unboxed on my channel. So I would love to hear your thoughts down in the comments below. And again, if you're interested in signing up, I do have that coupon code down below where you can get that $45 gift card um, with your purchase, which will get in an email after you subscribe to the box. Um, and let me know your thoughts down below. All right, up next, we have another new box to the channel. And this is the Red Box of Wellness subscription. This is a self-love in a box subscription and it's a mental health subscription which I think is amazing again this was sent to me free for review like all the other boxes today now there are different subscription options with this box there's an economy box for $36.97 or there's a premium box for $58.97 I don't know which one they sent me yet so we'll figure out once we get inside and then they do also have DIY boxes and those are also that $36.97 price. So I'll read a little bit about their mission because this is my first time unboxing the box, but on their website it says, our mission with this box is to inspire self-love by using self-care products and motivational books as self-compassion tools. When you unbox your box, you'll embark on a unique self-love journey guided to help you live a happier and more centered life. It says, note, we are not a beauty box. Now I don't have a code or anything like that for this box at this time, but I will leave a link down below in case you're interested in signing up. And the box itself is like super pretty on the outside and on the inside, look how pretty it is. It's so cute. Okay. I'm going to guess by the little tissue paper that this is a February box and look, there's even a dried flower. <gasps> I love that touch. All right. So there's a different paperwork on top. So it says, thank you. We really hope you enjoy your self love box. Did you know that we give back to our community? 
Um, yes, we are really big into giving back. For that reason, every month we donate 10% of our overall monthly profit to our favorite charity, the Compassionate Hearts United Foundation, which is dedicated to provide compassion-focused support to those in need, while at the same time building an army of compassionate hearts who can help them change lives of those they serve. Oh, that's really nice. And talk about self-care. Today's a good day to be kind to yourself, take a bubble bath, drink and eat well, do a wellness ritual, and cuddle with pets. And then they have some self-love affirmations. So I deserve to feel healthy and happy. I'm strong and beautiful. I feel energetic and motivated. And there's a couple more there as well. And then on the back, it gives you some grounding techniques. I'm a five, four, three, two, one. So, oh, I've done this before. My therapist has shared this with me. So five things you can see, four things you can touch, find three things you can hear, two things you can smell, and one thing you can taste. Um, so if you are feeling like you need to be grounded, this is a great exercise. If you're feeling anxious or overwhelmed. This is a really, really great tactic. So I love that they're giving you kind of those like self-care, mental health type things to help guide you. And this is on really nice paper, so you can like keep this. Um, it says, place this card where you can see it so you can keep yourself grounded as needed. Ooh, and inside it looks like there are so many fun self-care things. Okay, let's dive in. The first thing that I'm pulling out is some skincare. This is from Zyme Skin, X-I-M-E. Um, this is their vitamin C essence for brightening and moisturizing. So nice little brightening serum. Love a good serum. Vitamin C is great for the skin. Oh my gosh. I love the packaging. I love the yellow dropper bottle. I don't know why. And it's got frosted glass. I love that packaging. That's really, really nice. Ooh, then from Olivia and Allison, we have some coconut cleansing wipes. Are these makeup remover wipes? It looks like they might be. It says they're soothing and relaxing coconut water wipes. Um... So I guess these are just makeup remover wipes. I'm actually glad to get these because I almost ran out of makeup remover wipes and I had to like run over and buy more, but I'm glad to have another pack. These are Korean, made in Korea. So some Korean skincare and I love the scent of coconut. <gasps> Ooh, we've got some candies. We've got a bag of candies. It's five little hearts. I'm assuming that this is the February box. There's nothing that says that in here. These are Palmer's cookies and cream chocolates. That is a very, very fun. Y'all know I love a good snack. Okay, yeah, this is definitely the February box because there's like little, like, Valentine's Day confetti that says love and little hearts. Oops, and I'm dropping it everywhere. That's very fun. Ooh, and then we have a little coin purse. It's a little, like, fake snake skin or something. It's definitely fake. Um, but it's like in that pink kind of, oh, it feels, I love the way it feels. I don't know why, it just feels really good to me. And that's like little heart shaped. Um, so little coin purse there. Then from Kala, there's a lava pumice stone. So this is good like to use on like, I use these, I use pumice stones like on my feet a lot, like when I take a bath or whatever. So but you can use on feet, hands and body and rinse the rock after each use to remove any residue. Love that. Ooh, we've got some sheet masks. The first one is from Clean Color. This is their collagen facial mask, which lifts, smooths, and helps perfect pores. This is a 10 to 15 minute mask. <gasps> this one's so cute. It's got a little cow on it. This is the Milk Essence Mask. It's enriched with milk protein extract and various um, nutritive components that deliver abundant moisture and nourishment deep into skin. <gasps> This is so, so cute. This one you leave on for 15 to 20 minutes. And I'm just like, this is this little cow guy here. He's very cute. Then from Simply Magic, and I like they taped it down so it wouldn't spill in transit. This is their, I don't know, clean, sanitizes, and deodorizes. It wipes away germs, dirt, and allergens. Okay, so like a little disinfectant, like a spray disinfectant. Um, so a nice little spray disinfectant, which is nice. Ooh, okay, we've got a little cuticle oil as well going on here. This is the from LA Colors. And it's 100% natural with sweet almond oil. Keep those cuticles nice and moisturized. Oh, I love this. Mm, there's a little sachet of lavender. Oh, it smells so good. I love sachets of lavender. There's just something about it. This is great to like put by your bedside. Lavender can help you get like, you know, sleepy and wind down. If you want to like calm down, I feel like this is a great little thing to have. You could put it in your little coin purse. <laughs> oh, up next, we got a new brush. I always love getting a new brush. This is from Celavi. This is their divine brush. So it's a blue brush with just some regular bristles. I love the feeling of like the brush bristles, like touching your scalp. That can be a very soothing feeling or like you could like be 
I kind of meditate to that feeling almost. Ooh, up next we have something from Kala. We are, I think we had the like pumice stone, but this is their Beauty Reset Satin Sleep Collection in ivory. So it comes with a satin pillowcase, eye mask, and scrunchie. Ooh, it's actually, I actually really, that color will work on my bed which is really, I feel like normally when I get stuff like this, it won't work with my sheets, but I actually think that this one will. Okay, that is really, really fun. A nice little sleep set there. All right, and then we get to the paperwork. So you get, there's a little workbook. So it says the Red Box of Wellness, February's 2023's theme is loving myself. And it's a little workbook that takes you through. So let's see here. So they're important links. So there's a, you can take a mental health test. What's under, you can do a what's underneath worksheet. Um, so which will help you understand your true feelings. So if you're somebody who has a hard time identifying those feelings or didn't grow up in an emotional feelings based family, which like me, then that can help you. So you can try to understand your feelings, especially the more complicated ones. And if you need someone to talk to, there's also a link for that. So I love that in a mental health box. Um, then there's a little passage here. It says, pick up your anchor and start sailing from Ada Benton court, um, which is just kind of, will talk you through something and maybe a little motivational. Then they, it talks more about this month's, book, this month's book. So you get a monthly book. So this month's book, which we got in the box, is The Happiest People, Understanding the Science of Happiness by Jonathan Edward Begain, PhD. Um, nice big font in there and talks about different things. Um, optimism, there's a chapter on optimism according to this. So just some really nice things on happiness, which I think is really, really cool to read through. It's not a huge book, but I feel like this is definitely a workable book. It talks about relationships and all that kind of fun stuff when it comes to happiness. So very, very nice. And it's written by somebody with a PhD. So you know that it's gonna be a little bit more reliable. And then there's a happier you take action checklist. So there are some things that it talks about here. Maybe that, maybe it's related to what's in the book. I'm not sure. Sorry, I'm not even showing you a checklist here. So trying out, keep learning new things, awareness, live life mindfully, exercising, take care of your body, emotions, looks for what's good. So you can kind of go through a happier you checklist. Then they have so, show their social media and things like that. Um, so I really love that you get the little workbook to go with it that kind of helps you through the theme of the month. I love that you get a book to educate yourself more. I love that this is like, a, I don't feel like there's a lot of mental health subscriptions out there at least I haven't seen a lot and I think that this one's really good in that it's balanced it's kind of like a lifestyle box meets um health like mental health care if that makes sense so things that help you take care of yourself but then also some like actual real tools in doing that so I thought this was a really good box it's obviously my first time unboxing it um so I will definitely leave a link down below in case you're interested in signing up and I would love to hear your thoughts on this box down in the comments below all right, up next, let's jump into the cacao box for February. Now, if you're unfamiliar with this box, it is a monthly premium specialty craft chocolate bar subscription. It's a very, very delicious, yummy, high quality chocolate subscription where you get four to five premium bars each month. The box is $45.99 a month because you're getting some really nice chocolates. Some of these are like bean to bar and are made very, very well. Um, and I love this box. The bars in here are delicious. Sent to me free for review again. Now, last time I had a coupon code that I think was $10 off of your subscription, but I think some of you were saying that it wasn't, that it didn't work. I'm gonna put it down in the description box below just in case you're interested in signing up and if it works. When you open up the box, that is what it looks like. You do get a card on the cacao box which goes over how to taste chocolate. So similar to the way you might taste wine or cheeses or things like that. Um, there's a tasting way to taste it. So you prepare yourself, cleanse your palate, look, touch, smell, snap, taste, and enjoy. Personally, I don't drink alcohol, so I don't get to get in on all those tastings, but I can taste chocolate. And then it does come in this really cute bag that kind of looks like maybe like a cacao bean bag. Now you do get the monthly kind of like pamphlet or thing emailed to you each month. So I have it pulled up on my iPad here next to me. Ooh, and this month it looks like we have four different bars. All right, the first one out is from Cuna de P Piedra. Co oh my gosh, I'm gonna butcher this. Comal Caloco. I'm so sorry if I pronounced that wrong, but it's that's what it says. Um, so it's a group of Mexicans who are passionate about cacao. Their mission is to raise the quality of life of everyone involved in the process from those who grow and harvest the land to those who consume their bars. It's homage to Mexi Mexican cacao and each one of their chocolates reflects the best lesson mother nature has taught us. Good things take time, but are worth waiting for. Ooh, this one has a very interesting scent, or scent, 
flavor profile. This is their Tabasco with hibiscus flower bar, which is a 73% cacao. Oh, I am so excited to try this. Um, the hibiscus flower is harvested by the indigenous community Numagama Ski Mifa, which I'm sure I mispronounced, um, from who they have learned a special kind of devotion to Mother Earth and a true understanding of the whole greater of the sum of its parts. Um, the member of the community have been cultivating the Creole hibiscus tree for centuries, and this variety of, uh, was originally introduced to the Spanish galleons on the Pacific route from Manila to Acapulco. Ac Acapulco. Pulco. Acapulco. <laughs> My pronunciation, y'all. I really apologize. Uh, is known for being particularly robust and aromatic. So this is going to be a floral tasting bar. Oh, wow. It even tells you this is from a, the rainy season harvest of 2021. That is so cool to get that kind of information. Talks more about the bar on the package. When you open it up, this is what it looks like. So it comes in like black or brown kind of like paper and it has like words on it. I'm curious, I guess the bar probably does too maybe. So you can see some of the flowers on the back of the chocolate bar there. Looks like mine already broke a little bit and it does have like some actual words on the chocolate bar, which is cool. So let me break off a piece and taste. Let's try a bit. I like that bar a lot. It's leaving my mouth like watering. You definitely get the floral notes, but there's definitely some savory essence to it. I don't know if that's because of like the mention of Tabasco, but there's that savory note in it. It has those qualities that I look for in like a Mexican chocolate. I don't even know how to describe it, but it's like, it tastes like Mexican chocolate. There's just a, a, something a little bit different about it. It's not super smooth, but I'm not mad about that at all. Um, there's a little bit of grit in it and not a ton. It's not like a stone ground or whatever, um, but I really, really like that. It has an interesting aftertaste, which I'm assuming might be that kind of tab Tabasco type of situation. I'm not really sure, but it's super duper interesting. I really like that bar. Up next, we have a bar from Maru Chocolate. Um, this is one of the first bean to bar makers in Asia. Um, the founder left his advertising career in San Francisco and moved to Vietnam to find himself. Um, he met a banker from France living in Saigon with his wife and two kids, and they had nothing but a blender, an oven, cake tins, and Sam's Kitchen. Um, and that's kind of how they created this. They work with a tight network of small farmers who they buy the best quality beans from. So this is their Maru Duck Lock 70%. So it says here, buttery and fresh tasting. This cacao is grown uh, in Vietnam, central Vietnam amidst pepper vines and coffee plantations, le lending bright earthiness to this dark chocolate. So it has notes of red fruit and spice. Ooh, I'm very excited about this. I also love the packaging of the Maru bars. I think we got one maybe in the January box. So they're on this beautiful paper and on then on the inside, it feels like almost like a, like a Willy Wonka <laughs> bar because of the gold paper there. All right, let's taste. I really enjoyed that. That was very bright and light. And compared to the other bar, it's much lighter and brighter, which is interesting because there's only a 3% difference in the cacao content. But this one, you definitely get that, like, that sweet brightness of like a red fruit, which is one of the notes. I don't know if I necessarily get the spice. Well, actually, you know what? I do. It's a very light spice. I really like that. It's a very different flavor profile from the other one. And that's what's so fun is like tasting these bars and comparing them to one another, you do start to get the difference. Like they do taste different and you can pick out those different notes. It is so fun. Oh, this sounds so good. Up next, we have a bar from Raka, which is devoted to making uncommonly delicious chocolate that captures the brighter, bolder, and fruitier side of cacao. Um, they make every bar from scratch with unroasted cacao beans sourced from growers they can trust and admire. And the unique flavor of their unroasted chocolates is part place, part processed. Um, I'm really excited. They, um, the chocolate making process values the community of growers, producers, and makers whose livelihoods depend on cacao and chocolate. Um, all their chocolate is made from scratch, bean to bar, and Red Hook, Brooklyn. So this is their Rose Cardamom 70% chocolate, and this is a limited batch, which is exciting. Oh, and the packaging is really, really cute. So the Rose Cardamom Bar by Raka is a limited batch chocolate bar released only seasonally. To make this bar, Raka gently steams Tanzanian cacao over rose petals and cardamom, conjuring a luscious and dreamy floral bar. It's celestial, ambrosial, and transcendental. <laughs> I had a hard time with that word. So this is like a florally type of bar as well. All right, this one like opens straight up. It does have like a little bit of silver packaging, but opens straight up. The bar, I've, I think I've had one of these before. It kind of has like that type of pattern to it. All right, let's try some. Wow, another really good bar. Again, it's kind of light and bright. 
a lot of the bars I'm seeing so far have been fairly light and bright. I do get the cardamom in there. I don't know if I specifically get the rose, but I do kind of get that lightness, that brightness, that florally type of taste from it. I really like it. It's definitely different from the other ones, but they're kind of similar this month in some ways, which is also very interesting to kind of compare to. Um, and it tastes, they taste like, I don't know, it tastes really sweet. It tastes sweeter than I would expect the 70% cacao to maybe? I don't know, but it's really, really good. And then last but not least, we have a fun one. We're switching it up with like a little bit of white chocolate. So this is from Cacao Sempaka, which is created to propagate the culture of cacao, to revive chocolate tasting as a social custom, and to convey their passion for this legendary food of the gods. Um, they handcraft chocolate from start to finish and use real chocolate with no preservatives or coloring to create evocative language of shapes and flavors. Ooh, this is their roses and strawberry white chocolate. Excuse me, I'm not normally a white chocolate person. It's too sweet for me, but that sounds really good. So it says creamy white chocolate dances with crisp dried strawberries and rose petals. The rose aroma enhances the bright berries with a pleasant crunch and lingering sweetness. It's reminiscent of childhood fruity cereals with dried strawberries soaked in milk. The addition of rose comes through as an aroma and plays a supporting role in the crispy strawberries and sweet white chocolate. Okay, well, let's open this up because this sounds delicious. So this one opens up just like a box and then the chocolate bar comes out. And this is what it looks like. It's a pretty swirl. I feel like I've gotten a bar from this company before. I don't know if I've had this exact one before. All right, let's try a bite. Wow. I really enjoyed that. Now that one was obviously very different and it was going to be different because it was um, a white chocolate versus, um, you know, the other dark chocolates. It has a really good texture. Those dried strawberries inside provide a crunch and they're ground up to be fine enough. They're not like big chunks of dried strawberry. I really like that. And normally I'm not a big rose fan, but man, is the rose good in that bar. It just kind of balances everything out and gives that like light note. It makes it light and easy, breezy, beautiful. I don't even... <laughs> I don't even know, but it's really, really good. Um, so those are the four chocolates in the February box. This is a great thing to gift somebody. So if you need like a very last minute um, Valentine's gift, this would be a good one. Cause um, you'd be like, hey, it's coming for you. Um, and I really, really love these. I love tasting this box every month that they send it to me. Um, it's so interesting to try out the different bars and the flavors and see how they're different. I personally really, really love this box. Again, I don't know whether or not my coupon code is still valid, but I will put it down in the description box just in case you're interested in signing up. All right, up next, let's jump into a Haldi Skin Care Refresher. Now, if you're unfamiliar with Haldi, this is not necessarily an outright subscription box, but what this is is a personalized skincare service. Basically, they sift through hundreds of products to help pick you your best best skincare routine. You go onto their site, fill out the skin quiz. It'll take you through what your skin type is, what products are you currently using. It will tell you which of your products you're using may have ingredients that are not good for you. And it will build you a routine around the products that you already own. So if there are offenders, you can get, you know, toss those, get rid of those, keep using your favorite products that have good ingredients. And then you can shop the pick that Holly picks. So the quiz is free. I believe it takes two days and it's free to do. And then you can choose to shop their store based on the skincare they give you. Um, and then if you purchase any of that, you know that they'll help you with your skincare routine as they send it out and they'll provide you what that skincare routine is. And as you start to run low on products and you can go back in the store and pick some new ones. Um, and then I think, you know, with seasons and things are different, so you can get updated personal routines. So they, this was sent to me free for review. Um, and they have sent me an updated skincare routine, which I'm so excited to dive into. So they have sent me three new products, but they've also sent me an updated personal um, routine, like skincare routine, based on some of the things that they've already sent me, which is so great. So let's start off by kind of showing the new things um, they provided me. The first one is from O'Shea, and this is their Ondaria Algae Body Oil. Ooh, okay, let me tell you today, my skin was so dry. Um, I took a bath last night and I think I forgot to moisturize afterwards because when I got out of the shower today, my skin was like itchy everywhere and I had to like moisturize multiple times. So I am very happy to have this body oil. This is what it looks like. It says you can supercharge your skin with the unmatched marine moisturizer or moisture, excuse me. Our seaweed infused body oil delivers a rush of antioxidant mineral hydration that softens, smooths, and leaves skin glowing and rich yet never greasy. So really, really nice little body oil. I love 
the little pump on it. So that's really nice. And I think I already have an O'Shea, um, an O'Shea Ocean, Ocean cleanser as part of the routine. Then from Ryle Beauty, which I've never heard of this brand before, we have their Daily Detox Oil to Foam Gel Gentle Cleanser. Not gel, it's a gentle cleanser. Ooh, I love the packaging too. It's like an interesting shape. Ooh, it's like a twofer where you get the, you put the pump in separately. Oh, <gasps> look at how pretty this is. I love this. It's frosted plastic. It's not glass, but I love the way that that cleanser looks. And then you do also get a little pump that you can add into it. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I love the way that that looks. Not that that necessarily matters, but like I am about aesthetic and that is really, really nice. So you can put the pump in and then if you're not gonna use it, you know, you can close it back up for a little bit too. Really, really nice looking cleanser. Um, and they've added this into my night routine. And we'll go through the routines once I show everything. And then last but not least, they sent me this from St. Jane. This is their Luxury Sun Ritual Pore Smoothing SPF 30 Sunscreen. It says Desert Rose Hibiscus Jasmine. Interesting. Ooh, this is what it looks like. It's really pretty. The bottom even has, I'm not, it has like a little metal piece on it. I'm not even, I don't even want to like pull the plastic off, but that's what it looks like. That is so pretty and really, really nice. Um, so this is a sheer invisible texture that melts into your skin, beautifully blurring the look of pores. Um, the Desert Rose Jasmine and Hibiscus visibly smooth and calm sensitive and breakout prone complexions. Definitely need that right now. <gasps> very, very excited for a nice little sunscreen. Okay, so Katrina's personal holiday routine. Let's jump in. So for mornings, I use the Ocean Cleanser from O'Shea, the Restorative Mist from January Labs, the O'Shea Blemish Balm, which all are things I've gotten from them before. And then the new addition is that St. Jane Sun Ritual SPF 30 to add in at the end. So that's exciting. Then at night, I use this Ryle Detox Cleanser. Um, and then again, you can I can use that Restorative Mist from January Labs. I have an Alpha H Vitamin A Serum, which is alternate nights only. And then the Indie Lee Squalene Face Oil. They talk more about like the rest night where you don't use the serum as well. And then they give you a weekly thing. So weekly has the Raleigh Cleanser, um, the Josh Rosebrook Cacao Mask, the January Labs Restorative Mist, and the Indie Lee Squalene Face Oil. And then it also tells you how to get started with some of the new products on how to like massage, you know, use the cleanser or um, like the, make sure that you use the sunscreen at least 15 minutes before sun exposure. So those are the updates to my Haldi skincare routine. If you're looking to refresh your skincare routine with the new year, this is a great way to do it. If you want products that aren't gonna have a bunch of toxins and gross stuff in them, this is a really, really great way to do that. So I will leave a link down below to Haldi in case you're interested um, in signing up. Um, um, and or taking the quiz and you can take the quiz with no obligation or anything like that and then if you want to cho choose something to purchase out of the store you can to help build your skincare routine and I can't wait to use these updated um, items in my routine. All right, up next, let's jump into the Bath Bevy and the Bath Bevy Tubless boxes for February of 2023. Now, if you're unfamiliar with Bath Bevy, it is a monthly bath subscription where you get things like bubble bars, um, bath bombs, all sorts of fun bath products each month. It is $43.21 a month plus shipping. She then does also have a tubless version. So if you don't have a bathtub, you can't take baths, you don't like baths, this will be the subscription for you. So it won't have bath specific things. So it won't have bath bombs or bubble bars, but it may have other shower related things like a shower gel, shower steamer, candle, body lotion, things like that. That box is also $43.21 a month plus shipping. And I will leave a link down below in case you're interested in signing up, but let's dive into the regular box first. When you open it up, this is what it looks like. Each month the box is themed and this month's theme is love for February and Valentine's Day. On the back, it does list everything inside the box. So it does look like we are getting five different products, no. Six? Six different products in the box. Ooh, okay, the first thing out is one of her bath bombs. This is the chocolate covered strawberry bath bomb. Now she packages her bath bombs in these little boxes with little squiggles so that it doesn't get damaged in transport. And this is what the bath bomb looks like. I'm a happy girl. That smells really, really good. It smells like strawberries with chocolate. Oh, I love that. It kind of even has maybe a little bit of cinnamony-ness to it in the background as well. Oh, that is 
yummy. I can't wait to use that. I love her bath bombs. Ooh, up next, we got one of my, my favorite thing. I don't, not even one of my favorite things. Her whipped soap scrub is my favorite. Um, we got the XOXO, but you could have also gotten red velvet cupcakes. Um, so XOXO has scents of cotton candy, lemon drops, vanilla, and musk. I'm so excited. This is like my favorite thing to use. I love to use these like pre-shave. Um, it just helps exfoliate the skin. Oh, I want this in a body mist. Mmm, this smells so good. It's just a little pink scrub. They do come sealed. I These are like my favorite things ever. I'm kind of hoping we get another one in the uh, Tubless box. You, sometimes you do get like similar products or same products in both boxes. So I'm very, very excited about that. Ooh, uh, then we have um, the uh, Candy Graham bubble bath. Now you could have gotten in red velvet cupcake or Candy Graham. I got mine in Candy Graham. Um, this doesn't say what the scent notes are on either of the things, but I'm assuming it's gonna smell like candy. So it's a little nine ounce thing of bubble bath. Um, you can add one to two ounces to your bath as it fills. I feel like this usually lasts me about three to four baths. It is sealed, but y'all know we gotta smell it. That kind of smells like tropical fruit punch on steroids. That smells so good. Oh, I'm so happy. I can't wait. That's gonna smell so good. And this is also a scent that will pair really well with lots of different scents. Oh, I love that. I love that a lot. And I love the fun pink color for February. Ooh, then we got a nice big bag of Epsom salts. These are the Love Spell Epsom salts. So this has um, invigorating scents of mandarin orange, bergamot, and tangerine with notes of fresh peaches, strawberries, raspberries, and white musk. I love fruity scented bath products. So we are gonna open this up because I need to smell this. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that smells so fruity and good. Uh, and these two together would be insane. Oh, if you do a little back bath cocktail with that, mm, delicious. And this is like really generous. This takes a couple baths for me to get through both of these. So this is super nice. Ooh, then we have another bath bomb. This is the Love is in the Air bath bomb. Ooh, okay, let's see what color this is. It's a pretty pink and I can already tell you, I am obsessed with the scent. Um, so it says this is an intimate blend of juicy strawberry, black currant, and sensual amber. This is like a very sweet, sexy, sensual scent. I love it. I again want it in like some sort of perfume type scent. Oh, I can't wait to use this. And I love the pink color on this one. It's very dainty and really nice. And even the squiggles inside are light pink, which is like, I love it. Ooh, and then last but not least, we get a candle. This is a different type of candle than what we've gotten before. This is from B. Lucia Wellness Candle. Um, this is a healing wellness candle. Um, it cultivates love, renewal, and positivity. Um, it says the refreshing mint and the loving, gentle energy of rose quartz complement each other to create space for purifying and opening the heart and restoring trust and healing capacity. Ooh, so is it like a mint? There's rose quartz in it, but does it smell like mint? Oh, it smells good. So there's like little rose quartz gems on top of it and it does smell really minty, like sweet mint, natural sweet mint. Ooh, that smells really good. I love it being in this like little gold container. So a fun little candle that you can light while you take a bath. And she always gives you a little pack of matches to go or with it when you get a candle. That way, if you don't have any of that at home, you are all set to go. Oh, that is so fun. I love that. So that was everything in the regular Bath Bevy bath box. I thought this was so fun. It's so Valentine's-y and great. And I love every single scent in this box so, so much. Oh, I cannot wait to take a bath after this. But now let's jump into the tubless box. When you open the tubless box, it looks very similar. It just says tubless at the bottom. And the themes of the boxes are always the same, or at least they always have been so far. Products on the back, and there are six products. Ooh, the first thing out of the box is this here. Um, this is their Love Spell Soap Bar. Um, so I think this has the same scent as those bath salts did. Um, so it's a blend of mandarin orange, bergamot, and tangerine, enhanced with hints of fresh peaches, strawberries, raspberries, and undertones of white musk. And it's so cute. It's got two different hearts in it. They're two different shades. One's like a more purpley pink and one's a red with a lighter pink. 
and it smells really, really good through the packaging. So nice little soap bar. <gasps> yes, we got another whipped soap scrub. In this box, we got the red velvet one. That's the only one you could have gotten, and I'm actually excited since we didn't get that in the other box. Um, if you get both boxes, you may get overlapping scents or overlapping products, just as a heads up. The red velvet cupcake scent is a delicious blend of cocoa powder, chocolate, red currant, and strawberry syrup laid over pure cane sugar, buttermilk, and vanilla extract. Okay, we have got to smell that. <sighs> Oh my gosh, this straight up smells like a cupcake, a red velvet cupcake. I wasn't expecting it to smell so spot on. I want to eat it. Don't, don't do that. It's soap. But man, that smells so, so good. Oh my gosh, I'm very happy right now. Up next, we have some shower steamers. We got two shower steamers. These are in strawberry champagne. I can't smell much through the package. But what I can smell smells very good. So shower steamers you stick at the bottom of your shower. You don't want them in the direct stream of the water, but you can let the water hit them a little bit and they just create this wonderful steaming experience in the shower. So, so nice to get more of those. Then we have a body wash. Um, this is in the XOXO scent, which is the scent that I think I got and one of the other things over there that I loved. That was the other sugar scrub that I got. <gasps> okay, so this is that cotton candy, lemon drop, vanilla, and musk. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this body wash because I'm like, oh, I want it in a body spray, but I'll take it in a body wash. Oh my gosh. Mmm, that smells so good. This might be one of my favorite scents. This is really, really good. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy to have this in a body wash right now, y'all. I'm very happy. Then we have some Candy Graham whipped soap. So this is not a whip soap scrub, it's just soap. This has that same Candy Graham scent as the um, bubble bath. Here it does have a description of it. So it says, citrus notes with a luscious blend of berry and cherry over leafy greens and a base of vanilla. Ooh, okay. I, don't, I just, it smelled really good to me. Oh, it does have that citrusy scent. Oh my gosh, now that I'm smelling it more again, like with that. So it's just a nice little whipped soap. And it smells so good. These, like, these are some of my favorite scents, y'all. And then last but not least, you do get the Loved Wellness candle. The same one with the rose quartz that smells like mint. So you get another one of those candles and a set of matches. All right, so that was everything in the Bath Bevy Tubless box as well as the regular Bath Bevy box for February. I thought the boxes were so good. Honestly, some of my favorite scents. Like, I really love those scents. I wish I had smell a vision for boxes like this, but definitely let me know your thoughts down in the comments below, and I will leave a link if you're interested in signing up in the description box. All right, up next, let's jump into the Silver Swag box. This is one of my favorite boxes to unbox. Um, this is a monthly subscription for adults and seniors. Now, I am an adult, I'm on the younger adult side, the under 30 adult side, um, but I love this box as well, so I think that this is great for everybody. I would consider this like a monthly lifestyle box, but this was created to help busy families send um, love and stay connected, so you could send this box to loved ones and help be connected with them. So inside you'll get things like household items, um, home gadgets, activities, personal care items, conversation cards, and more. This box is $49.99 a month, and I do have a coupon code down below where you can get $15 off of your first box. When you open it up, that is what it looks like. It says the February box on the sticker. Ooh, it says from the Library of Silver Swag Box for the love of books. <gasps> okay, so like a book themed Valentine's Day box? I'm here for this. Um, okay. So you do always get a conversation card. So this is great to use with loved ones to kind of stay connected with them. So an example of the questions on this card are things like, what was the last book you read? If you were stranded on a deserted island and can breathe, bring three, book, three books, which ones would you bring and why? And there's obviously a lot more here. Um, I also love these as like icebreaker questions on like team meetings or things at work if you are like in that type of work where you have type of icebreaker things. Um, so this is really, really fun. And I love that that is a way that you can stay connected with loved ones or other people that you wanna connect with. And then the other card goes over everything inside of the box. The very first thing that I'm pulling out is some tea from Harney and Sons. This is their red raspberry herbal tea sachets. Um, so you can curl up with a little book and these are caffeine free teas, which I love. Raspberry herbal sounds really good. These steep for five minutes. Um, so it has a mixture of rose hips, hibiscus, raspberry leaves, natural and artificial raspberry flavors. Really, really fun. So I think there's three of them in there and I love the pretty pink color for like Valentine's in February. Y'all, 
I'm so excited about the next thing out of the box. <gasps> Uh, this is the Too Good Gourmet Valentine's Soft Bake Red Velvet Cake Cookies. This sounds so and good. So it's just a yummy box of cookies. For a second I thought this was something maybe you bake, but no, they're already in there. There's already the cookie. Like if you look inside, you've got your cookies there. <gasps> Those look really good. So these are the perfect little reading snack. Um, I am very excited. They're nearly 70% cake butter, batter and they're loaded with chocolate chips. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for these. My boyfriend loves cookies, so he's going to be really excited that these are going to be in my pantry. Now, this is not listed anywhere on the um, card, but we do also get some popcorn. This is from Dinan Gourmet Popcorn. Um, it's their Kettle Popcorn Sweet Singles. So nice little Kettle Popcorn bag there, which is also a great little thing for reading. Ooh, up next we get a little book light. Um, this is from If USA, and it's their really tiny book light. So if it's getting late and you just want to get through one more chapter, um, they've been there. So this little handy book light will help you get through all your late night pages. Ooh, very fun. That is so, so fun. So a nice little book light makes perfect sense in a like book themed box. Um, the next thing out is really exciting, and it might be because it's Kate Spade. <laughs> you get a Kate Spade tote bag, a canvas tote. Um, this is so adorable. It's like legit Kate Spade. That is so fun. Normally, I, I like we get a lot of canvas, like a lot of um, little like tote bags and boxes, but I love this one. You've got it's obviously got little books on it and the little dog. I love this, and it's like it's it's got like sides to it. Sometimes you just get like one that that's just goes straight down. This one actually has sides built into it and you get the little straps, you get your little Kate Spade thing here. Retail value is $26.95 in case you wanted to know. Um, and, but it also has an inside canvas pocket in there as well. I love this. This is a really, really nice tote bag and I love the design on it. I think it's so cute and so fun. All right. And that's everything in the silver swag box for February. I think it's fun. I think it's a fun book theme. I wish there was a book in it. That's my only thing. It would have been fun to have like a book in it. Um, but I think it's super cute. I'm the most thing I'm most excited about this, but I also love the snacks and everything else. So definitely let me know your thoughts down in the comments below on this box. And again, I do have that coupon code where you can get $15 off of your first box. All right, y'all, we are on to the home stretch. We're on to the last two subscription boxes. They're both from Go Jewelry. Um, we're gonna kick it off with the Wrap Club, the Mother Earth Wrap Club. Um, so this is $39 a month. Actually, both boxes are, but this one comes with a healing crystal wrap bracelet each month. Um, and for both of the boxes, I do have a coupon code down below where you get 20% off your first box. So you do usually get your wrap bracelet and then some sort of other little free gift. So you get your wrap bracelet here. And then the other thing, there's another little box in here this month. So we're going to start with this. It says, all is well. Start each day with a grateful heart. That was hard for me to read. Um, so let's open this up. Oh, it's a little pen. Oh, this is really, really cute. So it says, all is well with a little heart on it. I don't know if you're going to be able to read that there. And then it's got a nice little like rose gold geometric shaped heart on the top and it opens up. It's just like a little ballpoint pen there. Oh, that's really nice. And I love the little heart on it. It's super great for a February box, which I'm assuming these are the February boxes. Um, oh, that is so, so nice. So little pen. Oh, ooh, and then we get the wrap. So, oh, this is so pretty. So this month's theme is the hummingbird. And so the wrap bracelets in this be beautiful blue color and you have a hummingbird detail on it. So inside you do get the cards that talk about the gemstone meaning. Um, and then also like in this case, it talks about the hummingbirds. So we'll start with the hummingbird. Um, so while they are tiny beings, hummingbirds pack a lot of powerful, positive energy. Um, the hummingbird symbolizes joy, healing, good luck, messages from spirits. Um, and to some, the sighting of a hummingbird um, is a sign that cha challenging times are over and healing can begin, which honestly, <laughs> I hope that's what it means for me because I'm going to be honest, this year has been very challenging for me so far. Um, and then we have the gem, which is these are all sodalite 
um, there, and it encourages the rational thought, objectivity, truth, and intuition, along with verbalization of feelings. It brings emotional balance and calms panic attacks. <laughs> I need that. <laughs> it enhances self-esteem, self-acceptance, and self-trust, and balances metabolism, boosts the immune system, and overcomes calcium deficiencies. So super duper nice. Now the wrap bracelets in this come with these much smaller petite beads. Usually there's some sort of other bracelet in the other box, which we'll get into in a second, but they're bigger beads. I really love these little dainty ones. And the nice thing about this one is you can open it up as wear it as a necklace too. So if you wanted to wear this as a necklace with your little hummingbird on it, that is absolutely an option as well. And all the, um, and all of the jewelry in these boxes is handmade by the owner Sylvia. So you're helping support a small a women owned business if you get this box. And that is just such a cute little wrap bracelet for the month. And that's everything in the wrap club. And then we have the manifestation box by Go Jewelry. The 20% off coupon code works on this one as well. This one is $39 a month as well, but it does come with different stuff. So it comes with things like crystal jewelry, holistic self-help stuff, comes with personalized gemstones, bracelets, necklaces, healing crystals, two meditation cards, and astrology forecasts. When you open it up, that's what it looks like. And look at how cute that little sticker is. It's like a 3D, oh my gosh, it's the love robot. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with that sticker. And that's what it looks like underneath. All right, so we'll start with some of the paperwork items. So you get two meditation cards each month, one to keep for yourself and one to give. And this is what it looks like this month. So you, again, you get two of those. So it says, the way you treat yourself sets the standards for others. Sonia Friedman. That is so true. Set your set boundaries for yourself and stick to those boundaries. Um, so you get two of those, one to keep, one to give. Then you kind of have the theme for the month where you get to kind of read a little bit more. So this month it is learn to love yourself, know your self worth. Um, and uh, I love this. So it just talks more. So the, I'll just read the per first paragraph. February is all about love. While some people look to validate how lovable they are by how they are treated over Valentine's Day, I am often reminded that love starts from within. So a whole thing front and back. I'm not obviously not going to read through all of that right now, um, but it talks more about that self-love and getting to know your self-worth. Then you get your astrology. So I am a Scorpio, so mine is Scorpio. If you were a different sign, then you would get that one. Um, so it will kind of go through what your thing is for the month. So the first sentence, just so you can know, is February bring a brisker pace that you've seen in quite some time, Scorpio, and you'll be ecstatic for it. Um, yes, there is a lot of stuff going on right now in my life. I can know that that's right. So, um, obviously there's much more to read there that I will read later, but you do get your astrology. All right. Then you get a little bag that usually has the crystals in it. Ooh, yes. So we get crystals and a crystal bracelet. So the first thing up is the crystal. This is what it looks like this month. This is the rainbow aura titanium crystal quartz. Um, so this is known for its strength and power. It's a stone that can be used to help you find your own inner strength and to empower you to reach your full potential. And I love that it gives the little cards that tell more about them. So they could have looked different, but mine has a beautiful like purple magenta that goes into like a green color. And then you get the gemstone bracelet. So again, this has bigger gemstones than what were on the other bracelet. And then these, those ones here are bigger than those here. So the white, well, the big white ones are rose quartz, which is an excellent heart healing gemstone. Um, it's a nature remedy that can be used for treating any issues that needs emotional healing. And then the blue is a lapis lazuli. Um, and it is a symbol of truth and is brought to you to see yourself for what you really are. And at the same time, help you to accept those parts of yourself that you may see as undesirable. So as you can see, the crystals that are in this kind of go along with a theme for the month, which is really, really nice. And then we get into this box, which usually has the necklace. Oh my gosh, it's such a pretty necklace this month. Look at how stunning and colorful that is. So this is in, oh, I love it. So this includes the colors of the cr chakra crystals, which are stones that connect to the primary seven chakras in the human body. Um, and the chakra is a Sanskrit word for wheel, outlining each chakra as a spinning wheel of energy that moves in sync with each other. Oh, this is so pretty. I love it so much. And it's on a silver chain. And then on the back, it does have, you know, a little clasp there. Everything, like I said, is handmade. All this jewelry is handmade by Sylvia. And it's just so, so pretty. I love that. All right. So that is everything in the manifestation box in both of the Go jewelry boxes for the month of February. I thought they were really good. They have really great messages in the box this month. So I can't wait to read and learn more about the messages in those. 
Again, I have that 20% off coupon code in case you're interested in signing up. And with that, those are all 11 boxes in this subscription box Sunday. Y'all, I'm exhausted. I'm about to lose my voice and I always film these after work. Y'all, I am tired. And this makeup has been on my face since like 6 a.m. this morning and it is now 7.43 p.m. So I'm ready to take it off. Um, I am ready to curl up and take a shower and watch TV and do whatever for tonight and just relax. Um, favorite box? favorite product. This is going to be hard because there's so many things here. I really like the red box of wellness and their like mission behind that as a box, but I also thought that the um, Simply Earth box was really fun and I really love the jewelry of the um, silver and gold box, but my favorite product is going to be that lemon candle from the Copper and Pine Co. I just love the scent of that or maybe the towel, the towel with the rainbow and the four leaf clover or the three leaf clover on it because I thought that was so fun, but I'm so curious. That's like, it's really hard when there's this many boxes to pick those things. So I would love to know down in the comments below, what was your favorite box? What was your favorite product? That way I know you stayed until the end. Um, definitely let me know your thoughts on all of the subscription boxes down below. I hope that you enjoyed this longer video. If you've made it this far, I hope you've enjoyed your snacks and your drinks and hanging out with me. And I hope that you enjoy the rest of your day. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Make sure that you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss out on future uploads. And I'll see you in my next video.